Xylophone here to try out Ubel once again. I got a special Ubel Fire Fist deck that should make my own personal destruction very easy. We'll see how this goes against Mario's very good, um, Super Heavy Samurai. Yikes. I will just gonna go second so I can kind of judge what I got here. I haven't played this deck in a while, and it's definitely a much lower tier deck than Super Heavy Samurai. But maybe just sheer plot armor and willpower can win you the day. Alright. So, of course, I drew my my wagon, Very good. wagon's effect, yep. allowing me to switch it to defense mode, then, then I activate its effect, allowing me to switch it back to attack mode in order to add a an equip card to my hand. Of course, you know, I'm going to add my soul peacemaker. I'm actually Very having good. to hard remember everything right now. <laughs> like I'm, having so I'm to playing your memory. bell, man. <laughs> Don't complain. <laughs> I'm not complaining, I'm just saying it's like I'm have actively having to dig right now yeah, to remember. Sure. I think I know what I search off this though, and then I got that to work with, so we'll mm -hmm. see what we can do. Then I bring out Big Banky. Hello, sir. Then I also activate Trumpeteer. There we go. All Big right. juicy monster. That's going to be a problem. Okay. I could go into train right now, but I'm not going to. Is it even the optimal play? No. Because yeah. I can I can discard him and start burning you, but that's not going to be the play. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's your bell. How do I summon this thing again? <laughs> Let's see. Do, 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 do I just tribute to summon this thing? I completely forget. I guess you do as well. He's going silent. Alright, well, we'll go ahead and use terraforming. Sorry. Um, family walked in real quick. What did you say? Oh, I was just forgetting how to summon you, Bell. Oh, uh, it's normal tribute summoning. Yeah, it's going to be a problem. Okay. Actually, you can summon you, Bell, anyway. It's just her first form you can only do that with. The other ones need a destruction effect. Yep. Okay, uh, let's see. That you know, yeah, I'm going to activate. I'm going to activate this. I'm going to take your uh, Upstar Goblin for my turn. Yeah, sure. It's a great card to take. All right. So we can get, of course... Ooh, you know what? If only that was actually that good. Uh, actually, no, that one's not huge. Okay. Um, We are going to go for the Fire King Island. And then we can activate the Fire King Island. Then I can destroy one monster in my hand. I control, add another Fire King monster to my hand. Um, so destruction is on lock. If first of Fire King is destroyed, except Dragon Dash, I can special summon this card. That's not what we need, though. All right, here's what we gotta do. Eh. Could have said that as well, but we're fine. Okay. So, the thing I need to question is whether or not, like, that you have, like, reaction face downs or not. <laughs> Very much I so. Can't, I don't remember it, because I don't know. I can't remember if you run the fire fist in here or the ice fist. But hey, you get a free card. Yeah. Let's see what I get. I don't think I have anything for terraforming, actually. Now that I realize. Maybe not. Well, yeah, I I no, I don't. Yeah, I don't. Okay. Alright, do this. I summon out Magnet. Magnet's effect. Allows mm -hmm. me to special summon another level 4 out. I'm gonna bring out my Super Heavy Samurai Scales. Scales right. allows me to special summon another Super Heavy Samurai from my graveyard. And of course, I will bring out my Wagon. Very nice. In defense mode. Wagon special abilities. By switching it to attack mode, <laughs> I get to add a card to my hand. And I will add my Soul Peacemaker. Wow. Soul Peacemaker, equipping it to my Warlord, gives it a piercing. I so sit here contemplating why I allowed you to suggest this matchup. <laughs> well, I'm fair, riding on I've a Mr. Tomato play. <laughs> <laughs> it's against that one trap card you have in there. Okay, mm -hmm. there's Ubel, the monster. Mm -hmm. I can't attack into it. Yep, yep, yep. Or else I literally do what it wants me to do, and you deal me blowback damage. Oh, yeah. 
All right. Oh, actually, we're in business. Let's see. Fire King Island. Bam. And that can add to my hand. I guess we'll just get this. But since your bell was destroyed by something that was not its own effect, it can do its thing. There we go. Terror incarnate. I'm doing the thing. I right, know this is a good door again. Okay, I'll not be destroyed by bell. No battle damage, of course, before when he attacks. Um, inflict damage equal to the monster's attack. Neat. And it needs to attack a face of attack position. So, I wonder who we're going to attack. Um, I do not currently have a fire monster in my grave. Um, that can be for next turn. But I suppose, let's see, does this guy need to do anything to keep himself alive? And this card leaves the field special summon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or is that just the other U bell? I don't see that. So that's fine. So let's go to battle. Terror incarnate. Oh, I can only attack this guy, which uh, I'll probably just take damage from, I imagine. Or not. That's cool. Um, just nothing happens. And it's, the, it's the final form, I believe, that allows you to just tag into anything and deal with the massive amount of damage. Yeah, otherwise, you know, attack mode's pretty important. Yeah. Um, you need that trap card for sure, the uh, all, the final yeah. attack orders. But you can do this. Yeah. Soul Peacemaker, go. Which allows me to add a card to my hand. I need a way of getting... Ooh. Ooh. Battle Ball. Battle Ball. <sighs> Wait, no, I, I that actually won't work. You're Ooh, level 11. He's 11. Is, Thank there you. Is no, there is no level 13 monster in the game. That's right. Okay, I'm gonna set a card down. This is one of the reasons why that it's gonna be hard for me. Mm -hmm. You know what another reason is? As soon as that's flipped face up, he's mine. I don't want to play that card. It's fine. All right. Activate this. And you were wondering how you were going to win, Zylo. No, it flipped you real quick, I'll be honest. <laughs> the game listens to you. The second you complain. I know, I just had to complain hard enough. All right. <laughs> Let's see. Summon one fire-winged beast monster. Yeah. Let's do that. Because he'll start destroying things. Cool. And then we can add to my hand one of these here creatures. And I think that'll happen at the end of next turn, actually. So, yeah, that's fine. And we'll go for that. We'll be patient. We'll go for an attack. And you attack right into that attack mode card. Very nice. Yeah, he doesn't do the damage yet, though, so... We'll just make sure you're nice and light on materials. Giga gloves, go! Select the order from top to bottom. Not bad, not bad. What can help me though is the question. I need some way of getting rid of your you bell card. Hmm. Let me see. I think I might mess that play up actually. Yes, I 100% messed that card up. Oh, wait. okay. I'll manage next turn. Alright. Okay. Now let me think. And. Oh, no, yeah. That does work fine. Okay. Guess who is coming out? Yeah. No, oh, no, Garunix is not the one I was talking about. <gasps> oh, no. Here comes final form. No. Well, the final form at least has one has one downside. What's that? Um, it doesn't destroy the it doesn't destroy my entire field at the end of the turn. True, so. that's true. But it does have the added effect of you can attack whenever and just deal damage to me. Mhm. Mm Still, I only add deal damage equal to your attack, and your monsters have pretty low attack. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna special summon. Okay. My scales, scales of course activates the effect. Very nice. Scales allows me to special summon a card from my graveyard. Do that, which will allow me to bring that card out. 
Wait, when a special summon, select one of foot lower four from your. When this creature normal summoned. Yeah, no, also special summoned. Oh, wait, yeah, you're right. I misread that. But I still have one target. Battle Ball. Activate ah. your effect. Use the Garunix. Very nice. Susono. Activate. Take that part of extravagance. Yeah, decent. Fortunately, I cannot activate it because I Next need to turn. activate it the main phase. But I also activate my trumper, trumpeter to allow me to special summon. All right. Okay. Destroy all his spells and trap cards. That's annoying. It's so annoying. <gasps> because your own field spell destroys your field when it leaves. Yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, your own card actually hurt you right there. Because I had no way of getting rid of that, honestly. Mm -hmm. I think it's the Fire King duel now. I mean, you still should have, like, a second new bell in there, shouldn't not you? The or... Not a full copy. Not a full set of it. Okay. So it's just regular new bell, which is still annoying for me to try to get rid of, honestly. Yeah, but it doesn't do anything offensive to you. And it also requires you to tribute one card per turn to keep it alive. Yeah. Oh, we just got Savage Coliseum, too. All right. Which actually does make it playable once again. Um, downside is in my way of summoning it is currently in my hand. Well, it's currently in my hand, rather. Yeah, so we can't do that. Um, I guess what we'll do is we'll just... Yeah. Yaksha! Circle of Fire Kings! Darunix! I'm gonna take another one of your spell cards real quick. Go Ooh. for it. I'm gonna take a Call of the Haunted, actually. You're getting really good spells from that effect. I am. <laughs> Normally, I just take stuff to, so I don't have it, but you're doing great. Yaksha goes off. Barong goes off. And what do I get to do? Oh, yeah, I select a card to destroy. Um, I don't need any other stuff I currently have. Let's see. Hold on a second. Could you destroy one of my back row or my monster no, card? No, my cards. My cards I destroy. Okay. I was so gonna I... say you have good options on my side of the field to get rid of. Mm hmm Hand deck or grave. Oh wait, actually, yeah, we can do that fine. Never mind. Cause I, I forgot that I can play from graveyard. Neat. Alrighty. Alright. We will Run Savage Coliseum. Alrighty. So. Um, I'm assuming. Yeah, I can just fight that with that. Because it is currently. Oh, I can only target the magnet, of course. That's what magnet does. So we'll hit you with that. Now, can you do that every turn? No, it's when you sync or something, you destroy all the spells. Okay. So let's go for that. Not that I think there's much left for me to take. However, I think I could have done a little more if I went for this play. But we learn it. Okay, no, yeah, that just does that. However, at the end turn, shaboom. Mm. Okay. And this you're not you relying fully on relying fully on. Uh, on Fire Kings from here on out, oh, my butt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, this is the time to do this, which means I'm in the same predicament as before. But it's not the worst predicament to be in. I guess, yeah. I guess with, I guess it just needs to be either in your hand or graveyard for that effect, huh? Yeah, didn't think of it. All right, during the standby phase, add a Fire King card from your deck to your hand. Okay, cool. This is a lot closer of a duel than we gave you credit for. True, the beginning was rocky. Okay. You got scared when I was just spam something, get the cards I needed, let's get, let's us start attacking kind of deal. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, we can get that as a desperation card, right? Um, yes, we can. And honestly, that's the only thing I can really depend on here. So yeah, <laughs> Onslaught. 
Your turn. Yeah. All right. Let me see what I can do. All right. First off, I'm gonna activate this out of extravagance. Very I'll banish nice. three. You know, this may be one of those few duels, by the way, that might be like one and done because of how this is like going. Honestly. We'll see about that. Oh, haunted, of course, a great card. Third time to the field, Susa Noo. I mean, he's doing work. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> okay, you just don't want me getting it. No, there might actually be a potential play for that. Okay. Especially right. with Savage Coliseum out here. Yeah. Next, special summon my trumpeter. Wait, can I not? Where's my tr my train? I can't bring out. I need to non okay to uh two super heavy summaries i can't go into one it's only with the battle ball that you didn't go straight from your level 10 to it mm -hmm. okay let's see hmm what can i do like i'm honestly trying to scratch my head on what to do right now yeah well, first off i'm gonna do this So, let's do that. Okay. I'm gonna destroy your, uh, Grunix. Lovely. Activate triggered effect. What's the effect I wanna trigger? Because it ain't Grunix, I'll tell you that much. Uh, it's your let's Savage see. Coliseum. No, it's, um, it's Grunix. You can special summon when fire came from your graveyard. Um... So there's no reason for me not to do that. The big summon's already gone off. But that's going to be a weakness later, so why not just carry the field as it is? Mm-hmm. Uh, no, I would not like to activate the effect. I'll just keep that as it is as a desperate play. And we'll hold on to the nightmare. Remember, hold on to your nightmares. Yeah, let me see. All right. I have to attack, so... Alright, I guess this activates its effect. No loss <laughs> for you, really? Yeah. Gain, right there. So many effects. I should I should have been cheeky and put in like, some kind of chain burn effect. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Um, yeah, that's all I can really do. Although you're just gonna run into me and attack me. Oh yeah. Turn. Let's go. This game's gonna take a little bit of time. Uh, I am whittling you down. That being said, though. Yeah. Um, for sure. We're gonna stop messing around with all our weaknesses anymore. We're just gonna keep a nightmare on the field and tear you down. All right. So straight up attack. Mm -hmm. cool. So I'll get a nice 24 on you. Bring you back below full. Alright, and yeah, really, none of my stuff is quick play or anything, so I'll just end my turn and let this be as snappy as I can try. Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, I do have to click activate on Savage Coliseum, even though I'm attacking every time. Even if you don't mm. summon anything, I can attack your empty life points and do nothing, so... So I'm fine. Okay, yeah. I got nothing. That's no fun. I, I got nothing to summon is the issue. Yeah. But that is also one of the weaknesses of you, Bell. You need, you need me to summon. Hmm. Do I play a risky here? If you bring out a monster that is in the bell, you know I have a potential to finish you off. <laughs> mm hmm But the game's gonna last 40 years if I don't. How can I not play? Oh yeah, I can't do that unless you control a monster. Never mind. And I can do that. 
But yeah, I think we gotta start doing some damage. So, I just pull the monster reborn. Uh, we can go Garunix, uh, but when he's summoned, I'll lose my guy. So we're looking at your graveyard, Mario. And I can go Susanoo. Um, yeah, I can just put him out in defense mode, and then I know you can force him into attack mode, but that's okay. He's not terrible. Okay. So we'll go for that. And he can attack directly, and even in defense mode, right? It's just always, right? Can I attack. Well, okay, yeah. Making sure it wasn't like a stipulation when fighting a monster or something dumb like that. Alright, cool. And once per turn, if you control no spells in the graveyard. Well, that ain't the case, is it? Alright, so none of that effect, but we will get the Tapature here with the nice juice of that. I assume at this point is where you're going to flip that card right there. Unless you want to wait it out. Doesn't exactly help you much, but it hurts me a little. Oh yeah, you got that option, right? Yeah, get the add a card in my hand. Oh yeah, it doesn't help that particular thing. Um, but that's good. I will attack so I don't get destroyed. I almost forgot to. <laughs> and you know 300 life points ain't nothing and that card wouldn't have made the difference so we're good there good here hold on to susa no whoa okay hmm hey tied up at 22 eh yeah okay okay so in theory, we should be fine here, shouldn't we? Yeah. So, yeah, I'm just not going to do anything too too crafty. I'm going to just do this. Actually, you can still very easily save yourself. So I'm going to hit the face down with my uh, nightmare. Oh, yeah. 100 damage. Let's go. Giga Gloves allows me to adjust my next five card draws. Very nice. Okay. There we go. I'm actually kind of nervous about the next turn. And you probably should know why, but... Because now I have an attack mode, zero attack. Darn it! No well. Oh, darn it! <laughs> well, that could have been extra annoying. Um, so my play here... I was telling, I was planning on having some kaiju revenge against you. I can see that. Alright, I think... I mean, no, there's nothing I can do here. Everything I've planned for is already in place. So, nice zero attack monster. 2800 now, though. We're in a better pocket. Oh, Sekka's Light. Oh, gosh. Real good in these desperate times. Yeah, then activate it. I can target one card to return. Okay. Ooh, perfect. All right. So. Let's see. Yeah. Scales activate. Comes out. I choose my battle ball to return back to the field. Yikes. <laughs> what? I don't like Battle Ball, man. What can I say? Now I use my own sem Samurai Warlord to finally bring out the Choo Choo Train. Alright, let's see. Yeah, attack one does apply to defense for damage. Once you're trying to discard it with two cards, target that many cards your opponent controls, destroy him. Oh gosh, so you can totally just do that and destroy me, right? Mm hmm. Not if I destroy myself, I don't have everyone with him! <laughs> Good thing I didn't normal summon yet. Oh no, you didn't normal summon yet? Oh gosh. Oh, that's right, I can't because of that thing. Oh yeah. My only. I had to do final tech orders in order to save myself though. Yes, you absolutely did, and it was the right call. This couldn't have gone better, I'm so happy. The fact that we're so back and forth right now though. Mm hmm. This is like a dead even, like any psycho to win kind of deal right now. Yep. All right. Of course, you're attacked. So, yes, you get to stay on the field. Lovely. 
And now that you have a monster on the field, I can do Onslaught of the Fire Kings. Meaning, the boy is back in town. No effects. Effects negated. But that's okay. What's soul pierce again? Does that protect you for a turn or something? No. no it's it just, it's feels just there, isn't it? Piercing. That's why. Yeah, exactly. So, no real need. Do I... Yeah, the face town's terraforming. I go to finish. So, I can attack if I do that, right? Yes. I will finish this how we started, with a mystic tomato. Alright, Garunix. Take care of the wagon for me. I've already seen him use all three Giga Gloves, I'm pretty sure. That lets him out to hand, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let me see. Is there anything I can add? <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Oh, sorry. Hmm. I don't really think there's anything, actually. Mm-hmm. Uh, that really stinks. <laughs> yeah. I searched that onslaught so long ago, too. Alright, and I've had this Mystic Tomato in my hand for a very long time as well. Mystic Tomato, finish it how we started. Really close. Like, if I yeah. had made... If I might have made it some different moves, I mm -hmm. might have been able to pull this back even more easier. Definitely, because I, I had to to ride the line of having monsters having nothing quite a lot to even be playable right here. So, it worked out. No, I remember how this deck combos so well together now. and It's not bad, because you don't need the attributes to summon you bell. Like, it's every side card in the deck is for summoning you bell. The Mystic Tomato, Call the Haunted, Monster Reborn, it all works. So... Mm -hmm. Then I was lucky enough to get a Savage Coliseum out here, which is always fun. And, and the final attack orders, maybe not at the same time, which is completely brutal. But still, very nice. Hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing the return of you, Bell, here. I think it did pretty good, putting a yeah. fear on the field. And that terror just cleaned things up. The middle oh, one the was the scariest. The, the middle form is the scariest, but it's also the most volatile, as you can tell. Yeah. Also, because it not only, because you never really got to see it, but it also clears your monster field too, Zylo. No, that's the thing. But that's why this combo's out, because if I clear my own Garunix with it, then that just means I bring out the top Yubel monster. Honestly, if there's any more Spire King support, I would not doubt putting in Yubel. Yubel into it as well would not be, would be a good shout too. I don't know, there's so much stuff you need in this deck to make Yubel playable, but it worked. But at the end of the day, if it was just pure Fire King, I think I would have had an easier time. I feel like you would also, I think that would also give me more of a better chance though as well because your bell was the reason why I couldn't exactly keep moving forward. Yeah, well. that's what slowed you down and then the Fire Kings when time came just wiped everything. Well, actually, the, um, your bell and the Fire Kings wiped everything. They're very similar effects. Well, that's the whole reason why we put them together in the first place because they right. help each other out so much. So, with that being said though, mm -hmm. that's that. So, hopefully you guys enjoy. Oh. We'll see you guys next time. Sure. See ya, folks. <laughs>